Hey everyone, Phil Ebener with VideoSchoolOnline.com to bring you a Premiere Pro tutorial. Today I'm showing you how to do a feather transition, a wipe that has a feather effect like this one that you see here. It's kind of an old timey Star Wars technique and it's something that I wanted to do in a video project but all I could find in Premiere was just this wipe. That's the typical thing that you would add as a transition and it doesn't have an option for feathering the vertical line that is wiping across. And so it's actually under a different transition, the linear wipe that has the feather option. And so we're gonna get something like this transition in the end and it's actually really nice. It's kind of an old technique like I mentioned, you see it a lot in Star Wars and a lot of old videos, but it's something that can be used in modern videos as well. So let's get straight into Premiere Pro. I've already started a project and say you have your two videos lined up next to each other in the timeline. So typically you'd go over here to your effects bins and look under video transitions and wipe. And if you see this wipe here, you add it to your transition and you can see as it goes across, it's just this sort of typical wipe and when I click on the wipe transition and go under effects controls, there is no option for feathering. I can change the direction so it can come from the top or the bottom, but there's no controls for adding a gradient or a feathering. And that is because the effect that we want to use is not under video transitions, it's actually under video effects and if we go down there there's a transition folder and you go under linear wipe so linear wipe add it to the first clip what we want to do is move this up to the second layer and then scooch over the bottom clip as far as you want so that the transition can be as long as you want because as you see here the transition will last from about here to here Okay, so click on the clip that has the linear wipe and go to your effects controls. And let's keyframe this transition. So go to the beginning of the transition. Under here you have options for transition complete. Click on that stopwatch and that sets a keyframe. Then go forward in time until the end of the clip and go to 100%. So now if I scrub back through this, you see that there's this transition, okay? And then underneath here, there is feather. And so this is where we get this feather effect. So you can add it however much you want and then scrub through it again or play through it. And you'll see that you get this feather effect. Now that was a little too fast for me. So I'm going to extend this clip, actually extend it earlier so that I have more time to add a keyframe. So I can look at these keyframes that I added. So there's the first one right here and then the second one with the transition complete at 100% at the end and just move up this first clip and I could put my timer right there where the start of this clip is click on the clip that has the linear wipe and then move this keyframe to the time marker so now you'll see it's a little bit slower and I think a lot nicer of a transition the last thing you can do with this linear wipe is change the angle so you can have it go from top to bottom, left to right, and it's just by adjusting the wipe angle. And that's it. That is the linear wipe and that's how you create a feathered linear wipe in Premiere Pro. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in another tutorial. Hey YouTube, you like that video? Well, please subscribe to the channel for more. Check out our website for articles, webinars, books, and more. And of course, check out our online course library, ranging on topics from video making, motion graphics, photography, starting a business, freelancing, to beer brewing, resume writing, adopting a cat, and much more.